Well, guys, we're people with Harlow here. We're just out goofing around on the way up to the lake today, Friday the 20th. This is Marmon Valley, the horse farm. Zanesfield's a mile. And we're going into Valley High. I'm going to show you what my ski slope looks like in the summertime. It uh, looks like the horse farm's packed. You pay to ride horses and all that. that. That's the bunkhouse, just part of the farm. It goes to the top of the mountain. So we're in the valley, the Mad River Valley. And this building over here looks like the Netherlands or a Dutch looking building. I think that's the way they built it in Alaska too. There's some nicer homes up on, on the mountain here. It's glacier formed. I'm trying to run my AC and learn about the car. And it's a dark color, which is kind of unusual for, you know, it's a different kind of a place. It's a recreation. It, there's a sign to go back to the ski slope. And that's when someone breaks a leg, they bring the ambulance back here. But this car has a B. And when you're coming down the hill, this is Corkscrew Hill where they have the road race. Um, you, you put the Prius in B and it charges the batteries and it breaks the car. Uh, I think this is a park and ride here and then there, somebody's got a trailer there with uh, gyros or, or heroes or selling for the time being. Looks like I got a test car from the test track behind me. There's a seven mile over track over here, the research center and on top of the mountain there's a trailer park and a lot of people that live in the trailer park work at Honda and the research. I'll pull over and let him by and try to take a picture of him. But, uh, this is Valley High. I'm just going to hit my four ways and let them around me. So, Avalanche Tubing Park. They watch this car. It has a sign. Oh, it says Ghostbusters. I thought it was a research. I've seen the research cars going by my house. They're, they're testing some Ram pickups. But there's a, uh, a half pipe looking thing over there. that It's black against the trees. See they have these gates they put up. So I'm not driving back here. The one gate's open. I'm not going in there. There's people working. Do you see mow the grass? There's the snow guns. It's kind of a bad angle. But that's the avalanche tubing park. Can you see it? They cut down a lot of trees. Some nice looking uh, rocks there by the blue spruce. Buzzards are having a good day. But that's the avalanche tubing park where you go tubing and you ride up on a conveyor belt. But yeah, here's, I'm getting closer to this one. It's a half, that's pretty wild. That's new to me. Um, see, they're skiing and uh, snowboarding snowboard park they have and the rails this is the mountain for louis vito a 600 and some vertical drop and feet 600 foot vertical drop one of only two ski slopes in ohio that's the maintenance shed and they're in there working and they have the gate open but we just didn't have any snow and the groomers and all that breakdown and repair there's our brand new Ski Lodge made it look like the old one and these companies change hands these resorts and then some people invest their money in um, uh, Carnival cruise lines uh, Golf courses There's been more a lot more building of the houses Over here since Honda moved here in the 70s Which we had a, a family party up here when they first came That's our new rental building there to the left and that's where there used to be a hotel there where the rental buildings at and you go in there and they fit you mm -hmm. and uh, set you set up your bindings however tight however good skier you are but yeah a lot of people get hauled out of here in an ambulance They're, this parking lot will be packed and uh, to the other side of my car there's ponds and that's where the, a lot of the water comes from and it's pumped up there and the snow guns that used to be our kitty hill that's part of this um but you can see that at the top of the mountain there and yeah i went to go up there and someone's put a park model there there was a couple guys out there 
I'm sure they're busy today, and I didn't want to bother them with doing my vlog and uh, just start walking up there with the camera and everything. Or I would take us to the top and walk out there and look out over the valley. Just right now, we'll do it some other time if we want. Yeah, this is as close as I'm going to get here. See this other driveway, they have a kind of, you know, you could just drive through there, but want to be respectful and there's a, a lot of thousand gallon tanks over there instead of I guess they don't have gas to heat with out here some more of the industrial ends it looks like they must make a lot of trash they got a lot of dumpsters have a lot of parties there's a geodesic dome back there of some sort they kind of started going with the round buildings here this is our hospital and ski patrol building over here and this is a good close-up of the um, a snow gun. There's two of them. They move them around. I wonder if they like move them in or... They, they keep busy working and then there's people that work here just to fit you. And a lot of staffing. You get a ski for free if you work here. And you see how beautiful it is going up the hill. It's nice smooth pavement. But yeah, we're going up here to Valley High. Um... One of only two ski slopes in the state of Ohio. And um, we're going with the, with the A frame construction and geodesic dome up here when I turn it off. He's got a long cabin there. Pretty beautiful. The lots are cut pretty small. And um, they get super bad weather when you live on a mountain. You'd be surprised how gnarly it gets. And then the snow blows over here from the ski slope is a wild thing. And uh, no one else will have snow, but they have snow here. And yeah, I'm going to go ahead and cut the camera off and uh, go back down the mountain. And put this car back into the... It'll charge the battery here. Just put it while you're going. And it shows... And it's it's breaking and it's always charging my battery it's 80 almost 90,000 miles in original brake pads oh that pine tree looks like a goner and then the the geodesic and a-frames are hard to get alone on a lot of banks will stay away from them because a lot of the carpenters won't work on them Woohoo! really get moving I'm getting 100 miles a gallon now Yep, on the way to the lake with Bogart Rippy out here at Valley High. Thanks for watching, everyone.